Okay, today is the 22nd day of August 2024, and me and Austin are going to take these two vintage motorcycles to Globe, Arizona today. They'll so be making numerous stops along the way. And what we have here is a 72 CB550. Actually, it's a 72 CB500. And uh, it's my personal favorite. I love that motorcycle. It is just so much fun to ride that thing. So anyway, I'm looking forward to putting some miles on that. And then we have a 76 GL1000. Um, this bike has uh, some Krauser bags for it. We're going to start putting stuff in the bags. But we got rain gear and we got a way to avoid getting really soaked so beautiful day today we'll lube the chain on the cb 500 of course the gl's shaft drive we don't have to do anything there but two nice vintage hondas and looking forward to some riding today well hello everybody welcome to the channel fix and ride this is mark me and my son uh rode about 180 miles yesterday from cottonwood arizona to globe arizona nice ride so we took these two vintage hondas one is a 1972 cb 500 that's this guy right here pretty close the other one's a 76 gl 1000 obviously the gl was made for trips like that so really comfortable motorcycle both of them ran really good no problems it just ran really nice. Ran into a little bit of wetness yesterday, but it wasn't bad. Okay, well, anyway, let's talk a little bit about this uh, 72 CB500. This motorcycle, I've owned it for about eight years. I restored it. I brought it back from just a bunch of parts. And if you go onto the channel, you'll see some of the procedures I did to actually fix this old bike up. I didn't make it show quality it's it's got a lot of different parts from a lot of different years it's a it's a great bike though i love it it's it's probably my favorite out of the fleet of bikes it's just a sweet motorcycle to ride it fits me very well I'm about 160 pounds and it just it's just a sweet bike to ride um a lot of different parts from a lot of different years but anyway, if you if you want to go back into the channel, you will see some of the CB500 videos, what I did, how I took it from basically a bare frame and, and made a motorcycle out of it. Really kind of my favorite bike. Did about 180 miles on it yesterday. No problems. Never missed a beat. You know, it's just an old Honda. They're really, really reliable. Over here is the GL1000. This is a uh, 76 GL1000. Nice motorcycle, you know, water cooled shaft drive. You know, it'll do 75, 80 all day without a problem. Really nice motorcycle. This one here I've owned for about two years. Uh, I had to do some stuff to it, rebuild the car, you know, the usual. But as far as a, a, a long distance motorcycle, you could jump on that thing and go to New York very comfortably. Um, I added some Krauser bags, and I'll shoot some videos of that today. Uh, found a set of Krauser bags, had to do some repair to them. But uh, really just a long-distance motorcycle, not really a city bike, but they're actually pretty decent long-distance rides. Uh, probably holding its value pretty well right now in the market. I'm thinking these older GL1000s that have not been modified. If they're bone stock, they're holding their value pretty good. This one is stock. It, it has some accessories added to it, but there's nothing done to the motorcycle that could not be brought back to stock. So that's actually a pretty decent motorcycle. So we're going to be heading back to Cottonwood, Arizona today. It's about 182 miles. Uh, we'll be going along uh, Roosevelt Lake and then up to Payson up on the muggy on rim and then back down into the verde valley so join us on our trip today and if you'd like to subscribe and like these videos i appreciate it keeps them coming to you this is mark with fix and ride 
Have a great day. And remember, get out and enjoy your vintage motorcycle.